I see cases just like the Robert Lucy case every day today. I see them today when police kill innocent suspects and the police all cover for themselves and prosecutors cover for the police. Robert Lucci put his life on the line to blow the whistle on a narcotics unit that was accepting cash and drugs from dealers. I always wanted to be a policeman. There's a certain kind of bonding that takes place that you don't find in any other profession. Somewhere along the line, he got corrupted. 95% of the people in that unit were corrupt. And after a while, I just lost myself. I was not a policeman anymore. It was stealing money, stealing drugs, selling drugs. How bad can you go? Police corruption has always been there. It got worse when we started enforcing the drug laws very vigorously. We must wage what I have called total war against public enemy number one, the problem of dangerous drugs. It was a watershed of corruption in New York City. All the things that they've been doing, taking the money, the bribes and everything else. One of the cops said to Lucy, nobody can hurt us until one of us turns. The one who turned was Lucy. 52 cops were indicted based on Lucy's testimony. Worst rat who ever lived, the betrayer. People wanted him dead. He really thought he was going to be this great American hero. Instead, he became one of the most hated men in the police department. 